Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Straight Out of Norwood podcast. This is episode nine of Straight Out of Norwood, and we're pleased to be joined by the wrestling captains Nate Sue, TJ Wyman, Jack Brady. Thanks for joining today, guys. Yeah, thanks for having us. Thanks for having us. Yeah, thanks for being on. You know, you guys just wrapped up a huge season, probably one of the best Nord wrestling seasons of all time. So just take me through it. We'll start with Nate because, you know, legend. I mean, that's how you describe that's it. That's how you, you describe know? him. One word, legend. Legend. Norwood legend. So second place in, in the state. I mean, that, that says it itself. That's it's ridiculous. legendary. So just take me through, like, how'd you do it? Uh, just show up to practice every day and, you know, don't skip and you'll get it eventually. So is there any, like, specific things you do in the off season to, like, get to that level or are you just, like, natural? Uh, I don't really off season wrestle, so I guess just natural. He's born uh, with this talent. He must, it's, it's he's he's talent. got that dog in him. He apparently. does. He wow. does. And then wow. TJ, I believe, eighth in the state. That, that's not too shabby either. Yeah. Yeah. You know? How how'd you do it? Uh, see, I did a lot of off se- season wrestling with like Jack. Me and him just went at it on the mats, twenty four seven over the summer. Mm-hmm. It's pretty much that's what you have to do. Mm-hmm. The yeah. grind. It's a grind. It's a grind. Commit, commit it to the time. Yeah. Pretty much shows. every day over the summer, you guys. Yeah, were no. Yeah, a lot, a lot of nights, a lot of night shifts. Night. A lot of nights. It was and days. It was honestly. An and absolute it, grind. And it paid yeah. off. It did. It Eighth did, in the honestly. state, it honestly. worked out. But wow. JB, what about you? And then JB, you know. Uh, I didn't I didn't make it to states. Yeah, no, but you know. But you, you were. You put in the work, yeah. and yeah. you clearly helped TJ get yeah. to states yeah. by wrestling over the offseason 24 7, the night shifts. They you told, clearly. Yeah. They, helped told me, they told me before the interview, he, you're kind of like the father figure, you know. Yeah, it's a good, it's it's a good way to describe him. <laughs> so, yeah. how, how do you. You know, lead them in the battle. You know, it's just kind of, you know, part of being a good leader is knowing when to, you know, take a step back. Mm. Kind of let, you know, Nate cook. <laughs> let him cook. So, you know, Nate was always the one leading warm ups. Um, <laughs> you know, I was just kind of there to, you know, help them. Yeah. 100%. Nah. That's, that's awesome. Yeah. You know, that, that's, so you, you would just kind of lead him in the battle, you know. If you weren't having the best wrestling match, you knew that you had to kind of fire up your team and let them yeah. cook, basically. <laughs> let saying. them cook. Let them cook, you know. Let them cook. 100%. Yeah. So getting more like in the detail now with the wrestling, what weight class do you guys go at? Because I'm not really familiar with how uh, that works. I wrestle at 145. 145. Uh, I wrestle at 220. Jeez. I wrestle Big at boy. Big boy. What is it? 132. 132. That's very specific. That they is. Go up is by, so what do they go up by? They go up by six or seven until they get higher. Once they get higher, the, the, the weight difference increases more. So what's the range you have to be in? Like, Do you exactly have to be 220? Like uh, no, no, you just got to be under 220. Like, under 220. And above, like, 195. Or so that's the range, 195 to 220? Yeah. What about you, Nate? Is it? Uh, you just have to be 132 to 145. Okay. Nice. And was there ever like a, a scare like oh I'm putting too much weight on I, I gotta definitely. start it myself yeah definitely one of those during the season definitely. after Christmas oh. <laughs> one too yeah. many cookies one now. Too yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah we'll get you Jack what's your range uh, 126 to 132 oh, so you're a smaller range oh wow yeah, I'm a lighter weight class uh, so when you're, if you're a lighter weight class it's a smaller range wow. so did some nights you have to like you I hurry. can't eat dinner Right. No, I, I, I just, I, I don't really gain weight in the season. Mm. He's kind of just fit. <laughs> so. He kind of sticks right on it. Right. It's yeah, great. you're right there. Okay. Right. All right, that's yeah. it. So, is it easy? How, like, what do you have to, like, do when you, you got to lose weight? Do you stop eating? Is there a specific thing for wrestling? What do the coaches tell you? Uh, yeah. Definitely eat healthy. Um, and, you know, it's pretty restricted and yeah you just don't eat as much yeah and when when do you guys weigh in is that once a week thing what, what is that um so you weigh in like an hour before the match or a tournament oh yeah wow and yeah. then if you're i'm saying there's some strategy to that like Definitely. don't drink water before and then after you weigh in start chugging yeah 
100. Go to the bathroom. You gotta do what you gotta do. One, yeah, two, you, whatever you're like. Hey, you get into that strategy. match, do what you gotta do, you know? But I think we're getting right to that time. It's I that time. Bring that, I think Here he comes. We bring Nacho in. Let's, Let's bring go. him in, Nacho. <laughs> That's the fun. Let's go. Here he comes. There he is. Nacho. He's got a fresh hairstyle. Fresh hairstyle. The rules are you can discuss the questions with your group, but one person must give the final answers. You can pass any questions and go back. You will get one minute and 30 seconds to answer all the questions. And once you submit your final answers, you can't go back. The upgraded from a paper. All right, let me get the timer up. Oh, I did. All right, you ready? All right, question one. Yep. How many games did it take for the Boston Bruins to beat the 100 point mark record? 61. <laughs> question two. <laughs> what element does the chemical symbol AU stand for? That's uh, going to be gold. Question three, what's the smallest planet in our solar system? Mercury. Uh, which two states in the U.S. share the most borders with the other states? You got a minute, a lot of time. A lot of time. Kentucky. No, take your time. There's two. There's two. Oh, there's two. Yeah. Two, you got 50 seconds. Are you looking at Do you want me to repeat it? Cans of, it's in the middle. I'm going to take... Kansas, uh, uh, not, not Kansas, Kentucky and Tennessee. What are you talking right. about? Is that the final answer? Yes. All right, question five. What is considered the oldest sport? Wrestling. All right. All right. Those all your final answers? Yep. Yeah. Wow. Got it. What a performance. What? 31 this, seconds to spare. Is this a record wow. performance? Is, I think this is the best, best of all time. We've ever seen. Yeah. Holy. Right. That's, That's just uh, Jack for you. That's yeah. just Jack for you. Let stuff. him cook. Oh, question one, you got right. It was 61 games that the Bruins took. <laughs> I, love, I, I love hockey, man. I knew it. <laughs> he said it effortlessly. Give me gold. The Give me AU gold. symbol is gold. TJ got that right. Mercury is the smallest planet in our solar system. Uh, the two states that, the two U.S. states that share the most borders with other states is Tennessee and Missouri. One for two. Oh my goodness. And wrestling is considered the oldest. You were one state away from perfect. So you guys. Four to five. That is a t-shirt. Four and a half. Four and a half. That is a t-shirt. They are getting uh, a T-shirt. They, they are the first people on the podcast. It's been nine episodes. Nine. And they're getting. They're getting a T-shirt. Hear me out, Dylan. Yep. So we got half right on question mm. four. All right. So that's four and a half questions right. <laughs> right. Four and a half rounds up to five. So I say we get the Lewis card. <laughs> I don't think. Um, so. Unfortunately, it's not. Unfortunately, Trey on North doesn't know. do that. We're a little cheap over here. The but. committee. They say you need to get all of it right. So. All right. But we got to congratulate you. That's a record-breaking performance. Huge performance. Haven't I mean, I do have to say that Nacho did write those questions, so they might have been a little easier than usual. For the first time, he has. Yeah, I usually in. write them, so mm. I will say that. But, you know, nevertheless, great performance. Got to give it to you Got to give credit where credit's due. Yeah. yeah. Uh, can I give a shout-out, though? Yes, you can. Uh, shout-out to Miss Sheffield because uh, she got me gold. Actually. <laughs> right, she did. Uh, she Huge shout out. You got that pretty quick too. Yeah, I know. Before like, JV. She showed me this video, it was like AU giving me my gold back. Right. Like AU, you know. Right. Oh, so. I mean Okay. Wow. Wow. That's how they got that. There you go. Well congrats to you guys. You will be getting your T shirt off camera. Off camera type of thing. Right. But so, you know, individually know how good you guys are, but as a team, how did you guys do this here? Mm. We really turned it around. Like we went into this, it was kind of a, you know, rebuilding year. We graduated a lot of people. We didn't have a lot of success early on, but then something just clicked around. When was it? Like Christmas? Yeah. 100%, yeah. Hundred percent. Around Christmas, we started doing a lot better. Wow, really, it's clicked. And that's how it's not. It's not how you start. It's how you finish. You know. Mm. Yeah. No, definitely. Yeah. That's it's great. You guys finished strong. It's yeah. the way. Yeah. Sometimes it takes a little bit to click. Uh -huh. Probably had some new people had to step up big time, and then. What was your guys' favorite meat? Um, um, match. Match. Wouldn't the handsome one was uh, electrifying. It was yeah. Good. Yeah. <laughs> it was good. Yeah. It was electric. It, was, it was, honestly was. It was electric. Alex Dunstan. Alec Dunstan. Absolute stud. <laughs> stud. What's Dude. his weight class? 120. Ooh. Feather One Jason Lee, too. Wait, what? Jason Lee. 120. Stud. Stud. He, he wrestles at that weight class? 126. 126. They're like the one, two, like, 
In your opinion, what's more entertaining, watching the featherweights wrestle or the big bodies? Heavyweights, uh, yeah. Featherweights, probably. Yeah. It's just gritty. Is this, right? like, like make It's you not laugh. so much about, like, size. It's just, like, yeah, it's getting just... gritty because you're so little, you know? Yeah, you like, are little. Alex, Dun Alex Dunstan or Jason Lee is one of my favorite wrestlers, wrestlers to watch. They're awesome. Awesome mm. to watch. Yeah, they set the tone for the team, <laughs> yeah, for sure. Yeah, they're tone setters. They're Spark tone setters. plug and tone setter. Tone setter. <laughs> so, you know. Wow. Yeah. All right. Well, we know about them now. Yeah. So, uh, what do you think? Like, what team do you think challenged you guys the most this year? Uh, mm. Probably uh, Ashland. Ashland. Yeah. yeah. They, they got, got some tough. big boys over yeah. there. Yeah. Strong. You got well cooked by them. So. You did. Yeah. It did. Hey, it happens. Back, it happens. Yeah, it happens. Happens in all sports, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Is what it is. But. So I do want to see, like, we have potentially the GOAT of mm. Nord Wrestling right here. Right. You know, I don't want, you do have one more year left, so you definitely have more to, more to go. But from you guys, like, how do you see this, him perfecting his craft? Like, what do you, like, in your perspective, what are you seeing? Like, witnessing greatness every day? Uh, <laughs> day in and day out. It's honestly amazing seeing him just cook, like, absolutely everyone. It's awesome. But... To get to the next step, he's gonna have to join me, Jack Brady's house, just soft season workouts. Off -season. I have to put on yeah. some night shifts for sure with Jack yeah. Brady. Yeah, yeah. You, you're prepared to do that this year. Awesome. Definitely. Take your game to another level. Yeah, it's well, it's gonna be electric. It's gonna be. Do you see your game like getting even that much better, even though how high you are? Uh, yeah, I could increase for sure. Yeah. That's it's great always, to hear. That's it's, a Nord fan. You love to hear That's it. great to hear. That's a promising thing for all those wrestling fans out there. And scary sights for other towns to hear yeah. that. That I can get better, as Nate said. Yeah. That is scary. That the team should do a lot better next year. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Too. I you mean, think? it sucks that we're losing one of the best JB. to ever hit the mat. But Oscar Batista is my weight class. Yeah. <laughs> He's giving the shoes down. He's giving them. It's time to hey, hang so, him up. So he'll, Someone will fill that role, and, and oh, you know, yeah. it's tough to lose JB, but it's big shoes to day, fill. You left this program it better is. than it was <laughs> when he came. It so. is big shoes to fill, but yeah, you know, that's why it's a team. I am curious people. though, you know, playing basketball. You know, you always hear the wrestling team on the other side of the wall. Mm -hmm. You know, you don't really see what's going on, but <laughs> it's loud. It is. So take me through a practice. Uh, you know, we warm up. You know, we do uh, some drilling. We learn some new moves. Wait, drilling. some what? Some cool. Drilling? What's that? Um, Drill them to the mat? So usually we'll like, I don't know, like <laughs> hand fight. You like Whoa. kind yeah. of. Uh, <laughs> what, do we, what do we think of a hand fight? Can, you get Can we get a demonstration? Yeah, a demonstration, JB. Demonstration. Please, would you? JB, thank you. Appreciate oh, it. I, need to, I, I can't yeah. do this. Don't. Hold on. Me. Don't. I'm up. Hold Don't. Up. You got this. You gonna know, like, what are you going to do here? Oh, 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 yeah. Okay. Move that. Can we move right, that? Make sure you're in the camera. Am I going to get drunk? Like, what's no. going to happen? May happen. It may happen. We don't know. <laughs> Just like that, yep. Yep, yep. yep. So you got to do some back. Really you got to do some back. Oh, dude. Do some back. Let's go. Yeah. 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 Take him down. What about take him down? Bro? Take him down. <laughs> My season's over. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. What up? What up? Whoa. Oh, 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 He's on the floor. And I'm done. <laughs> JB <laughs> takes him down. <laughs> I mean, that was most of his matches. Yeah, that's wow. what you see out of Jack Brady all the time. Down. That's just him. Absolute. It's so what specimen. happened? What was wrong with my Absolute technique, specimen. though? I it's, went for the no, I went for the legs. It's what not happened? you. It's not you. It's Jack. It's the kids. <sighs> it's the it's, hours. It's so unstoppable. It's just it's the night shift. I'm not gonna yeah. lie. I thought I had him. I went for the legs, and then he just did some like thing with my head, and I was done. And he was yeah, on. You were pinned. pinned. I mean, I was pinned. I mean, the once you counting down. What do you do? Grab my leg now. Throw it over my like. What is? What happens? How do you pin me? Wow. That's not good. It, we got a fire alarm. We have a fire alarm. I have cast. never seen this. Right, this wow. is unbelievable. Um, this is unbelievable. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to have to pause. Yeah, no. Yep. All right. Fire alarm. Yeah, thank this you. Is unbelievable. All right, we'll be back. Oh, my God. Yeah. Now yeah, we're back. You know, a little fire alarm. Sorry, Dylan's, oh, Dylan's actually here right now. Ah. 
Yeah. Baby, tough one. me out at right leg. Yeah, he, he, he had to take a visit to yeah, the nurse's no, office. Yeah, no, I did. I was at the nurse's. I'm sorry. You know, I got to elevate my leg. But, yeah, JB took me out. That is, that's what happens when you wrestle Jack Brady. Let me tell you, he it's is going to take you, you know, out. He will take you out. And, but nurse said you're, you're fine? MRIs are clean. We're good. MRIs are clean. We're good yeah. to go. So it's good to thank skip God. No, thank God. That track season Most of the kids, honestly, jeopardy. aren't fine after Jack Brady. No. And when I got into the ring, Whatever the mats, yeah. I I knew the risk. Yeah. And I went for Most it. people don't even know the risk. And no. they just yeah. hop in there and think they're like, no. Nah. No. It's just. If it wasn't for this podcast, I wouldn't know the risk, but now I know the risk. And, and that's what he's been doing these last four years. Uh, Legend. Those, those night shifts. So do you have anything to say? Well, you're Wrap it up. retiring, you know, hanging up the, whatever you call it. The shoes, yeah. The shoes. Uh, the shoes. <laughs> a lot of golf in my future. <laughs> you do have a spring uh, season, though, don't you? I do. I will be running track this season. I think that's the official announcement, actually. I He's an announcer. Whoa. 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 Yeah. My retirement home of the spring track team. Uh, it's going to be fun. I'll be joining you, JB. Yeah. Whoa. We got Noah. We got Dylan. Yep. Whoa. Got Dylan I mean, my O'Brien. announcement. I will <laughs> join the track team. Yes, you are. Yep. Congrats on that, both Thank of you. you. Thank you. TJ, you got anything for the spring? Uh, no sport currently. No sport. So next up, football. Yeah. Next up, football next season, Nate. Anything for you? Uh, just some night shifts with TJ until Jack's done with golf. Yeah. Until <laughs> Jack's done with golf. One. Oh no, track. Oh yeah, track, track, not track. golf. Yeah. I don't run at night. Oh. Oh. Whoa. 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 All right. So we can start the night shifts right, right. That's tonight. Good. Good All day. right. It's a good day. Tonight at Jack Brady's. Be there. <laughs> be there. Just be there at six. Yeah. Dinner. That's just how selfless. Is there, is there dinner? J- J- or is it just he's rolling, well, even though he's done wrestling. He's willing to continue mm. to make the future brighter. Right. And that's why he'll always be remembered. He's a leader. A legend. He's said. the pure, leader. Pure leader. Absolutely captain. pure. Pure leader. And yeah. Well, this is a great podcast. Yeah, great podcast. Thanks yeah. to the wrestling team. Yeah. You know, we got three studs right there. I wish all the best. Mm-hmm. For Thank you. Thank you for having us. Thanks for having yeah. us. Yeah, yeah Thank thanks you. for At joining. At least we got another year left. JB's hanging him up, but you JB's know, up, but you he just witnessed his last takedown, ladies and gentlemen. Last pin. That's true. That is a pin, and that was the last one you'll see. Yeah. But thanks for joining, guys, and yeah. best of luck in the future. Thank, thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you guys. Thank, thank you. you. Yep, that's going to do it for this episode of the Straight Out Nord podcast, episode nine. You know, it was a great one. Great episode, and was. we'll see you guys next time. Thank Pe- you. Peace. Peace.